And lastly, we're going to talk about the urine flow, um, the anatomy of that. We said that once you've created that elimination product, um, it's going to have to be removed. And that's what urine is. Once the filtrate flows into the minor calyx, um, that is where urine is first formed. And once it enters into the structure, it is eliminated, meaning that you are getting rid of it. There's no way to be able to go back and get it out. So imagine, if you will, back to our closet idea where I've created this pile of stuff that I don't want anymore and I'm going to eliminate it. I put it all in trash bags and I'm going to send it off to Goodwill. Um, once it gets in that car and goes to Goodwill, you can't get it back. So if you start thinking, oh, I forgot about this one shirt in there I wanted, you know, at that point it's too late. So that's kind of what happens with the minor calyx. Once the fluid goes into the minor calyx, it's now called urine and you can no longer reabsorb any material from it. The minor calyx will empty into the major calyx, and you can see that this is a cup-like structure that is going to combine more than one uh, minor calyces. The major calyx will empty into the renal pelvis, which is this large area. Uh, you can see it unites all of the major calyces together. From the renal pelvis, the urine will empty into your ureter. The ureter is a tube that drains away from the hilum of your kidney. You've got a right ureter and a left. Both of those ureters will unite and drain into the urinary bladder. The urinary bladder is expansible, so it has rugae just like the stomach, and it can expand based on the volume that it contains. Once the micturition reflex has been initiated, the bladder will void, and the urine will exit through the urethra. Okay. So I hope that that addressed everybody's concerns with the urinary system and you can see with our final flow chart how all of the pieces come together and how blood flow is related to activities in the nephron and how the final elimination product that urine will exit the body.